Okay. All right. All right, come to the bar. And you're going to come right up on the bar. The, the deadlift stance is going to be quite a bit narrower than the squat stance. And it may be a little narrower than you want it. So close it up just a little bit more than that. I was already more, more than I was. Yeah. No, that's, that's right. going to be about right. Toes are out. Toes are out. Those of you, there's a very specific reason toes are out, but it's technical and I don't want to bore you with it today. I'm already boring you with just the deadlift. So we're going to, we're going to do an inch from the shins. Okay. The bar will start an inch from the shins. Now that's right over the middle of your foot. So if at any point before you pull this off the floor, you move the bar, you've undone this step number one. Don't move the bar. Don't move the bar. Step number two, you're going to take a grip on the bar, but you're going to do it without lowering your hips, which is going to mean that your knees stay essentially where they are right now. This is a high hips position. Get used to the idea that you're going to bend over without lowering your hips. Go ahead and take your grip. And this is a double overhand grip on the bar. It's exactly right. Now, bring your shins and your knees forward until they touch the bar. That's it, right there. Excellent. Now step number four is to squeeze the chest up so that the back goes into extension. And this thing down here, like we learned in the squat, squeezes down into an arch. And here's another thing to think about. I want you to drop your belly down between your knees. Good, good. Shove your belly down low. See how that enforces that position? And now, Push the floor away from the bar and drag the bar up your legs. Just exactly like that. And the finish is here. Make sure your shoulders are back and the chest is up. It's not a shrug. It's a lifting of the chest. Okay. Now, we're going to set it down the opposite of the way we picked it up. So you're going to slide it down your thighs by moving your hips back. And then as the bar crosses the knees, you unlock the knees. And that's exactly what it ought to do. Just like this. Same procedure every time. Highly reproducible, this movement can be. Knees forward, shins touch, out. Just exactly like that. The bar never leaves your legs. Where do I need to look? Down, up? All right. Again, I'm going to show you. Should have already mentioned that. Inefficiency on my part. Come on. You're going to look at those 45 pound plates right there. See the top of those plates? Look right there. Okay. Maybe even at the floor right there. Right? And the uh, eyeballs do not move. Okay. okay. Knees forward. Good. Just exact. Chest up. Really finish at the top. Remember that position. That, that is unfinished deadlift. That's a finished deadlift. Proud, be proud of your titties, okay? Gotcha. For normal life? Right? For the there you go. That's exactly right.